Hidden Object Guru here, back for more Shadow Play, Darkness Incarnate. Uh, we were just thrown out of a uh, train. I seriously have a headache from the last game I was playing. I'm really glad I left the room. Yeah, no, it's bad. Um, which was also about light monsters, but these ones are shadow based, and that one was strobe light based. Uh, okay. The other one was a crime against humanity. Well, it's funny because I, here's how bad Injection Pi 23 is. I am a person who is not susceptible to strobe lights in video games. I don't have seizures. They don't give me headaches. Unless it reaches a certain threshold. And that one leapt so far past that threshold as, you know, I had to quit after one minute of it. Two minutes of it? But anyway, a very short amount of time. Ooh, he's not just Yeah. Let's fix that plate. Put up a video about Metro Sim Hustle, everybody, if you want to know how I feel about taking a train. <laughs> well, then you can open up the video I just posted about Metro Sim Hustle, and That's I, I think you're going to be surprised. I have been stuck in my head all day. It's the best song in the world. That's Bohemian Rhapsody. That's also a good song. Maybe not taking a train good, but very good. Clothespin. Springy or the other kind. Hey, Shaggy. Hi, Shaggy. Uh, yes. Uh, my bra... YouTube doesn't want to accept a stream from Restream today. That's why we're only playing on, uh, Twitch. Sorry to disappoint. I'm going to try to get the problem sorted out overnight and that might mean we have to only stream to uh, uh, we might only be streaming to YouTube and not Twitch for a little while. I mean, the hidden object stuff. Uh, guru stuff. I mean, obviously when I'm writing Criminal Minds that's still going to be Twitch exclusive. I'm not, you know, a monster. I know, I know where people are psyched about uh, Criminal Minds. That toad has a crown. I think he's a frog prince. So, what does it mean when one's green and one's white and when one's yellow? Okay, hidden. You have to assemble on screen. So that's a ruler. Here's the thing I have to put in the locket when we find it. Right? See? Got it. And then the other ones are just hidden behind stuff. So yeah, they have three types of nonsense. Can you deals. move the leaves? Yes. I really thought I could move the leaves. Can you... Footprint. Feather. And bullets will be in here. No, I really thought the bullets were going to be in that box. Is that the bowl? Okay. No. So I was watching an episode of Criminal Minds. Skull? Oh no, I agree. I was watching this episode of Criminal Minds, and uh, it was one in which Banksy was murdering people. It was a terrible episode, even by Criminal Minds standards. And the guy, Banksy murdered people by, and this is true, hanging a guy upside down from a rope, putting a giant, like, six foot tall mouse trap underneath him, and then triggering it so it would slam onto his belly, crushing him. I'm like, you know that the physics of that don't work, right? Like, the bar that big, the spring just would not function. And if you did manage to design one that big, a human being could not build it on their own. They would have to, like, contract that out. And, like, nothing about it makes sense. And I'm like, essentially the killer on this week's Criminal Minds was Wiley Coyote. Also, it was just a disaster of an episode in every respect, but, you know, that's Criminal Minds Wait, for you. was he also a rock star? What? The Banksy guy. No, I'm no, their Banksy the was, was a lady. Probably, uh, oh, no, he is, he is Robert from Massive Attack. <laughs> Aver everyone basically knows that now. Uh, yes, it is weird that I'm not watching E3, but the only news I wanted out of E3 was what is Rebellion up to? And the answer is... Uh, what do you call it? Uh, a new Evil Genius game for the first time in... Uh, evil Genius game for the first time in more than 15 years. 
I guess 16 by the time it comes out. And then uh, also Nazi Zombie Army 4, which is a new Nazi Army game built using the Sniper Elite 4 engine. I was hoping they'd announce Sniper Elite 5, but that's a good half measure. What about Yakuza? No, no announcements from Yakuza, because it's Yakuza's primarily thought of as a Japanese franchise. What about um, this is the North Star? Same. Well, it's the same no. company, so... But no, I haven't heard, heard any about news. The fact that there's a new Xbox coming. Oh yeah, that's and very interesting. Very, it seemed very excited about the fact that Keanu Reeves is in a video game. Well, of course. Keanu Reeves is in a video game. Yeah, I'm worried because I can't uh, I can't support that video game developer because of their human inhumane business practices. So I'm hopefully they sort that out before it comes out, so I can buy the Keanu Reeves game. Are you teasing me, Shaggy? Did they finally, are they finally making a Judge Dredd game, or are you just teasing me? Because it kind of feels like I'm just being teased. But apparently, the uh, lazy writer is going to uh, Google, it, Google this for me. Google it, because I'm excited about the idea that there might be a Judge Dredd video game. Well, it's about time. These guys, like a video game copy, uh, company, bought the rights to Judge Dredd, and then they made one video game more than a decade ago. I'm like... You own Judge Dredd. Yeah, you are teasing me. That's what I thought. Yeah, there's not. Of course there isn't. The last one was Dread vs. Death. Again, in what, 2006? Yeah, something like that. 2003? Oh my god. It's been 16 years since there was a Judge Dredd video game. And Judge Dredd is owned by a video game company. What kind of sense does that make? I'm so mad That's about this. It's a mean thing to do to somebody. Oh, there's the ignition card. Yeah, but I knew that, uh... I really got a sense that there wasn't going to be any big news out of this year's E3. Because it's like... The console generation is ending. Next year, the new consoles are coming out. And so... Oh, that was lucky. Alright, so green, 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 green... Green. Alright, so this is purple. Uh, purple, purple, purple. Oh, wow, that was a weird coincidence. So let's find yellow. I don't even know the Nintendo announcements have happened yet. No, Nintendo doesn't do E3. They do their own. Well, I mean, they might have a. I don't think they have a presence. Aren't they just doing Nintendo Direct now? They're doing something tomorrow. Oh, okay. They are going to E3. I thought they were just doing Nintendo Directs now instead of even going to E3. Damn right it should. But yeah, it's like, there's not going to be any big games announced, simply because, like, the console generation's over. There's nothing left to come out. Except for Cyberpunk 2077, uh, the game with Keanu Reeves in it. And I'm, I agree we should all be excited that Keanu Reeves is in a video game. I'm not crazy, okay? But, what else is really coming out? Well, oh, it looks like you're taking a train. To villainy! I'm more excited about the fact that Keanu Reeves is making a Bill and Ted, uh... Movie. It's about time. Right? I'm super excited. Okay. Oh my god, you have to build some stairs. Did you just climb up the railing? It's got scopes on it, right? No, you just, just put your feet there. Yeah, it's that's fine. What I mean. Well, that's not climbing the rail. That's just, you know, using the steps. Just stand at the edge of the steps, as you point out. There's plenty of room to put your shoes. Because you're going to put the weight of the boards on there anyway, so... They did not make me work hard for those boards. Done and done. Yeah, like, I'm sure Nintendo will have some interesting stuff to offer, but... Again, you know, like, the console generation's over for the consoles I mostly play on, so I knew this E3 wasn't going to be anything special. I was just hoping to get an announcement for, uh, Sniper Elite Japan, and I didn't even get that. I'm excited about no more Nazi Zombie Army. I'm not crazy, but Sniper Elite Japan, everybody. Or, more importantly, get me a Golgo 13 video game. I know it's never going to happen, but... Hi! We have the best sniping engine that's ever been devised. No one's made a great Golgo 13 game ever. 
this really that difficult for people to figure out? Nice. Now I can use this to smash some car windows. Take that portable television. I am, and I think the biggest thing is, I don't want to judge them too harshly, but E3 is generally just cinematic trailers. Like, every now and then they'll have a thing that is, you know, nice extended gameplay trailers, and a few weeks after, or in the week after E3, we'll see, like, the gameplay footage that people shot at the various booths, but all the presentations are generally just cinematic trailers, and I don't care about cinematic trailers. I only care about what the game is like. I'm very shocked at you. Don't tickle my feet. That was an accident. It was very obviously. Was it though? You moved your hand. Let me to see. My Actually, what? yeah, that did seem intentional that second time. There's a good chance <laughs> it was intentional the fingers. first time too. I would never wiggle a finger. Later, when he screams in pain, you'll all know why. Nah. All right, let's do it. Let's solve the f out of this puzzle, people. I didn't say it was. Okay. Hello. Can anyone yes. hear me? Done and done. I would love a new Criminal Minds game. It's sad that the only Criminal Minds game we've ever had is a hidden object game. Don't get me wrong. I famously love hidden object games, but you know, let's full on do a really in-depth hidden uh, Criminal Minds investigation. <laughs> Okay. Who's there? Help! That should be about right. Oh, is this it? There it is. No, nope, that's not it. There we go. Ta-da! No, that's not it either. Well, that's weird. No. Hold on. No. Stop looking at the screen! Yeah. At a certain point, we bring heartache on ourselves. Alright, so now I've got a tiny thing here. Let's see if that fits somewhere. There we go. That took me long enough. That's right! Your soul will be mine! Yeah, I actually listened to there. I mean, I know I was talking too, but I feel like it did not say your soul will be mine. The shadows are getting stronger. And I have to get to the asylum fast. You do, don't you? That's good to hear, Maddie. I hope you get the support soon. Damn right the radio's busted. It exploded because it was possessed by shadow demons. Why is there a... Safe hidden in the wall of a tiny uh, radio uh, office of this, I think, the place where they controlled the train bridge? That is quite a lock. Also, is that really deep enough to have a good lock? Okay, can I grab that? Alright, so I have to find a tape to listen to there. Gotcha, Maddie. Well, that's not so much to ask. Nothing easier in the world than getting a bank account. I will use this. Oh, I need to do flashlight first. I thought I could just reach uh, down with the umbrella. But no, you had to see what you were looking for rather than just feeling around for it. Yay, we found the audio tape almost right away. past, obviously. We paused our experiments. We paused our experiments. I'm afraid our luck is running out. When Michael How came that to not me with the book thing? he found, I was excited about the possible rewards. Okay. Rewards. Rewards. Oh. Okay. Using light to control See? the shadows seemed to be working. Yeah. I thought we had discovered an incredible gift for but I slowly realized Michael was going mad I'll ask with the power. He was losing control. 
when dm is going to be by slow. So we need to express the concept of slow, so we click on snail, and then we need to express the concept of power, so we click on jolt cola. No. Uh, we click on butterflies, the most powerful thing of all. Really, nuclear bomb wasn't power either. Where are you trying to get power? Oh, control. I thought it was power. I said mad with power, so I assume we were dealing with power. And we need control, so... Remote control? Um, the switch? No, that's not control either. So I oh, that was remote control. All right, that's embarrassing. Some of my it, really looks exactly like to a it does. It's a very popular style. Papers to a secret well, location. I yeah, no, secretly I created an addition to the lamp that can destroy Ooh, the shadows. Oh, nice. See, it was a picture of a spy. Yeah, I got that. And then new to the destroy. The abandoned yeah. train station. The lamp is locked up there now. All right, and locked is a. Uh, padlock. Nice. A dial, you say? I would love that. Now we can open the safe. Except I still don't know the combination, so... Thanks for nothing, audio recorder. Uh, what's in here? Sleeping pills? Do I need to drug the shadows with sleeping pills? Because I'd be fine doing that. Don't get me wrong. Are we ever going to get another... Uh, hidden object game with a plot as crazy as a group of doctors are finding serial killers finding people children whose organs match those serial killers and then kidnapping the serial killers and then running them through a gauntlet in the woods to see if they can earn the right to survive and if they don't expect uh, escape harvesting their organs and saving children's lives with them because that might be the single most bonkers premise for a game I've ever played. Now, where do you think there's something to do, game? In here. Really? What do you think there is to do in here? I've searched everywhere for the combination. There's nowhere left to click. There's something to pick up that I'm not seeing? Torn up paper on the ground? You didn't have to dial the combination. You just had to put the combination dial in and then not dial any numbers, and it opened. That was unexpected. Nice. Damn right it could. I still want to know how she was cursed in the first place. That's the question I'm left with. All right, I concur. I agree. That was tickling. It was totally by accident. No one could say I did that on purpose. See? Yeah! So many tools, everybody. An idea which one I need? Oh. So I just needed his code. A5TY4D. So, as, thank you, 40. That's not a good way to remember that. I'm going to write AS. That's, that's on me. A5TY40. That counted as a puzzle. I really feel like that shouldn't have counted as a puzzle. Alright, so now I need to move you all the way up. Uh, so... Probably could have done that in a lot fewer moves, but, you know, in the essence of time. I think it worked out okay. 
Uh, where are the lights? Here? Ow! Thought that was gonna be a puzzle. It kinda looks like I'm just knocking on that to make it work. Ah, there you are. Nice, Shaggy. I hope your orientation goes very well. But as you said, you've already done the job before, so you should be good to go. that these? Yes. Okay. And that's these, so up, down, up. So weird that there was a video, like, that Artifacts Monday constantly does rip off video games. You know, ripping off a prominent other video game franchise or film. And, you know, that they thought to themselves, you know, it's going to be big. This Mortal Engines movie. Let's rip that off. The steampunk Zeppelin thing. And now I swear to God, they've probably sold more copies of their Mortal Engine ripoff video game than people saw that movie. You had your chance to die peacefully. Jesus. Now, I'm afraid you're passing What's wrong with this guy? much more. Drowning is not dying peacefully, creep. Hello, Ford. I see you made it out. Uh-oh. Michael, you're alive. I didn't want to leave you alone with those things, but... Yet you keep trying to I kill had me. no choice. Well, I'll, I'm going to suggest you do what I always do, Shaggy. Two alarms. The shadows are free now. There's no hope. But at least my betrayer will die first. That's true. Three is good if you're very tired. Damn. That's a good way to do it, too. No. Oh, I have to? Damn! I just got out of that water. Lady, that was like 20 feet. Oh my god! Don't move! I pulled you out of the water, but oh I no. won't hesitate to shoot a runaway prisoner. It's worse prisoner. and worse for this lady. No, wait. Shut up. Just blink if you understand. Good. I tried to call the police, but all the lines are down. So now, we just wait. Wow, she's the worst, huh? Wow, that thing ran out of batteries immediately. That was legit, what? 15 seconds of battery Don't touch time? That. Don't move. Okay. What's that? The bridge is on fire. Oh no. Threw some sleeping pills in her coffee. Sorry, lady, I'm going to need to borrow this shotgun. Oh. I'm not allowed to take a shotgun, even though I'm definitely going to need it to deal with Michael. While her purse is here, we might as well steal all of her money. I should have guessed that wouldn't work there. Okay. Picture of her with a little girl. We've got... A map of the area and a uh, cloth. Weird that I can keep looking at that. What's underneath this table? Just a mat, I guess. Looks suspicious. You mustn't break anything. What is wrong with you, lady? Break everything. This woman's trying to murder you with a shotgun. Looks like we're gonna have to 
Fix a boat! Boat fixing. It's the cornerstone okay. of all great hidden object game design. Have we seen that depiction before of the boat on the shore? Because I feel like I've seen it in another game. I think it's just a very common image, but I understand what you're saying. I think you're just a little trick because you've seen so many boats on so many shores. Hammer! This boat is already 50% way to fixed. Oh, that's true. It's probably about dollar a doll arrangement puzzle. Alright, let's go break a piece of glass and wrap some cloth around it. Well, so let's... Oh, we're not having to... Yes, we're doing it, everybody! This is happening! Hold on. Let's make this glass knife, everybody. Probably should look at it first. Genius. And then we're going to fix a boat, and it's going to get even better. Alright. I definitely know what I'm supposed to do here. Check the circles A and then rotate the symbols B. Move all the symbols to their correct position. Yes. So that's two yellow on the outside. Then I need two blue out there. I see. And so now I just need to swap out all of these and we're good to go. So it's just a question of moving you here, moving you there, so then I just need to get the green one in this one, and the purple one in this one, and we're done. Yay! Problem solved. Oh wait, I forgot to go looking for the... Uh, hidden eye symbols, didn't I? That's one, and... Do we have another hidden eye symbol? That wasn't as scary as you thought it was, game. I do appreciate the fishing line, now. Oh, it's Fuse! Am I gonna blow something up? Weird that there was a World War I uniform lying around. And now a picture of England. I guess map is the word I was looking for there. They're hitting off my screen yet? I'll tell you. You just relax. Here's the fan. Need to shut that off. Now to jam the hammer in there and stomp up the fan so I can grab that key. And to jam the ore in the... Okay, well, I just have to find the switch. Now you have to find the switch here, see? Actually, can I remove the other switch? I cannot. Hidden object scene? Maybe you can pick it. Or smashy smashy? Worked. The answer is almost never smashy smashy, and that makes me super sad. Now let's bail out that boat. Alright, so the fixing a boat starts at uh, 29. It's a hidden object scene about fixing a boat. Weird. Squid. A match. Rubber gloves. We're still looking for the match. That was a picture of a match. So every time we find three items, it lets us bail out some water. Okay. That, that makes sense. 
Yeah, now I need a sport bottle and a lure. There's the lure. What is a sport? That's a sport bottle. Okay. Beach ball, cracker, hammer. So the hammer is underneath something. Cracker is underneath something. Underneath the flotsam or the jetsam? Ah, that was the transforming object. How could that have survived? Even still. Duck! 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 Hey, have I ever told the story on the channel about that time we were swimming off the boat and I yelled at you, Duck! And you ducked? Well, of course I did. I was told to duck. Yay! We found it! And then you looked at me like I was crazy, and I was like, there's, there's a family of ducks swimming right towards you. Yeah. And then you swam with ducks. Well, ducks are the best. Everyone knows that. Now? Oh, wait, there's the button emblem. Got some real Resident Evil emblem design going on here. Yay! Knitting needles! That'll totally let me pick this tiny tiny lock yeah we'll see about that wait no that all i love that they put in an animation for that even though it didn't work there we go wait what It's a weird way to handle this, but okay. It's 537, but in Hebrew numerology, that's the sign of the sun. The Nothing I just said brush. is true. Uh, yeah, shaving brush, nonsense watch, and we need sunglasses, which are in the sunglasses case, quite obviously. Matryoshka! It's true. That is the life of everyone in a Resident Evil game. Okay, this is kind of funny as a uh, button interaction goes. Instead of having to find Matryoshka dolls, I just had to find the one. That's, that's pretty funny. Alright, so the order they go in is purple, blue, green, red, yellow. 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 Purple, blue. Purple, blue, green, red, yellow. Oh, hell yes. Looks like somebody's fixing a boat, bitches. Didn't want to get as hostile with that. Apparently someone needs their foot rubbed as well. Uh least convincing no I've ever heard. I'm embarrassed that you even tried to pretend that was a no. Yay! We found the lock! Turkey. Y'all knew what I meant. Alright. Yay! Looks like we just had a great time. Or did we? Ha ha! Alright, let's check. So I haven't found the collectible on the beach or on the bunker. We are halfway through this game. That's crazy. Oh, he sees the eye. Where is it? Shaggy. Oh yeah, there it is. On the floor. Thank you, Shaggy. Alright, there's also an eye. Oh, the eye's in plan view here. Alright, let's fix this boat. Boat is already fixed? Nice. Let's boat the F out of this place. We did it, everyone. We made it back to the haunted demon asylum. Which is one of the best kind of asylums to have to go back to. Oh, crap. It's a puzzle. 
Apparently there are both huge amounts of rocks and whirlpools in this channel. Good question. Nice. Oh, come on, really? This does seem ridiculously dangerous. No! She is very good at poking. Alright, now there are Krakens and lightning storms as well. It's almost like someone doesn't want me to get to this place. Oh no, it's just an octopus. Forget it. Nothing to be afraid of. Damn! I did not go fast enough. What? <laughs> I got struck by lightning! I just, there's no way to predict where the lightning's gonna hit or when, so you just have to go. Right all up there. I would have beached myself down here because it was less dangerous, but she's like, no, I've got to get as close as possible. <sighs> Crazy lady. Alright, this is going to be a perfect time to wrap it up. We've made it back to the Haunted Asylum, and we're going tomorrow, hopefully, we'll have finished this whole thing. Why did you do a scary sound effect? Literally nothing scary happened. Now something scary happened. Anyway, as I was saying, I've been the Hidden Object Guru. Thanks for coming on this journey with me. If you had a good time and you'd like to see more, uh, there's buttons for that coming up. Questions, suggestions, related whatnots, so go in the comments section below the video. Uh, if you'd like to uh, enter in the quiz, drop a comment into the comments section as well. That is where I uh, check for your answers. We'll see... Oh, let's just finish this. Uh, okay, I need a fishing lure, which is definitely in plain view. What is that? Oh, spark plugs. There's that. I need a hand drill, and I need a leaf. Perfect. All right, let's call it. As I was saying, I will see you back here for more uh, Shadow Plane, the next item on the playlist. But until then, au revoir.